Mackenzie, it might not be the dog days of summer just yet, but that doesn't stop our next guest from playing one. Yeah, I sat down with Philly star outfielder Andrew McCutcheon to talk about his acting cameo on Disney's Puppy Dog Pals, the future of the game, and if the Phillies are feeling a World Series or bust pressure as fans are allowed back into the stands. Take a listen. Let's talk Puppy Dog Pals. You voice Kutch. What's he like? Oh, yeah. Kutch, man, is a... Actually, like full names like Wackerford P. Cutchamuch. That's the, that's the full full uh, okay. character name. Uh, he's, he's a cool like uh, card playing dog. Um, so he, he's uh, he's basically like really nice guy. He's trying to lend a helping paw to Bingo and Rolly while they go on their journey to uh, to find this uh, missing Marcus Bestie, who's played by Mookie Best. Uh, this Marcus Bestie baseball card. So uh, Cutch is just trying to lend a, a helping a helping Paul. That's basically it. Why yes I do. Wow, you're good. The baseball card. Yes. All right. So how catchy is that theme song? Do you know it by heart at this point from listening to it with your son and then also <laughs> being a part of the show? Oh yeah, I mean, yeah, pretty much. I pretty much have like the entire <laughs> song down. Come on, yeah. he's got a lot to do. It's gonna be an awesome adventure. Like, I got the host. Hey, yeah, but, uh, we got it. <laughs> going on a mission. Going on a mission. Five, four, three, two, one. Let's go. Okay. Like, so it's like, yeah, I had the whole, we, yeah, we, we, we sing that song a lot. So, I was gonna say, is this, is this gonna be a thing for Philly? I'm pretty sure the Nats had Baby Shark. Is this like a possibility? <laughs> I have no <laughs> idea, but yeah, I definitely would take Puppy Dog Pals over. Over anything. Looking back at an article you wrote um, back in 2015, you talked about your journey and, and the interest of the game of baseball. I loved in the article how honest you were. And you, I think you brought up some really good topics or points um, of, of the barriers of entry to baseball. I'm curious why you think there are fewer African Americans playing baseball these days, and, and what are those barriers of entry? Yeah, honestly, I, I, this this sport alone uh, is a very expensive sport. All sports are expensive at the end of the day. Uh, but the, to have that support financially, um, it, it's really tough. Um, you know, the, the amount of loopholes I had to go through to get to where I got, um, it, it took a lot of support. And, um, you know, I, I think with this game, you know, it's, it's tough. It's tough for, for uh, single parents. It's tough for parents in general to be able to support these kids. And they're, they're dispersing away from these inner cities and they're going uh, to these to these cities that are they're starting these games, these, these travel ball teams, the AAU, these tournaments, you're having to pay so much money just to get the exposure for these kids who can't afford it. And um, you know, when I was when I was younger, it, it, we, we were able to play anywhere, and it didn't matter. We play in a little tournament uh, city over. Now those are going away. So now you're having to to really have the money. Um, finances to be able to play in these tournaments and I think that's why so many African Americans and kids uh, aren't playing the game it's, it's just because it's just honestly just really hard to, to afford when it comes to the Phillies they've made major investments in players over the past few years is the vibe with the team right now World Series or bust and, and what's the mentality in Philly versus past contenders you've been with yeah I mean we definitely don't look at bust uh, that, that's not a number of vocabulary but um, yeah, we definitely feel we have a, a, a good team that can shoot and push for that that World Series championship. Uh, I think we got a good nucleus of guys on the team who can uh, who offers a lot. Lineup is amazing. We do have the chance to do have an opportunity. We, we, I used to remember coming into Philly uh, when I was on the opposing side, and it, it was a very tough place to come and play. Um, yeah. And uh, yeah, I, I, now that I'm on the the, the Philly side. Um, yeah, I just would love to just continue just to bring that back because it's, it's not a very comfortable place to play if you're the opposing team. So we have the fan base. It's going to be full capacity very soon. So I'm looking forward to it. I'm curious as to how much you think fans really do affect your mindset when they're in the stands because we saw with COVID how much different it was just from watching it on the TV. But for, from your guys' perspective, how different can a fan really affect your mentality during a game? Oh, it, it's big time. Um, I, you know, I, I look back. Um, just when in, in 2020 uh, mm -hmm. playing when there were no fans um, and comparing it to when there's even, you know, 30% capacity, uh, it makes a difference because uh, you're, you're having to find ways to keep yourself into the game. And as we know, baseball isn't like uh, other sports like soccer and, and 
football and basketball where it's, it's constant movement. Um, but, you know, so a lot of times you can find yourself just not paying attention. And I, and I definitely found myself doing that um, last year. But having fans uh, that, you know, I always I always joke with people uh, when they're when the, when the ballpark's packed, it doesn't matter the temperature. If it's if it's 50 degrees, you don't feel it. You don't feel the temperature just because you have all these fans. We we're just recently in Atlanta at full capacity there. And it was a little chilly, but you couldn't tell it just because you're just you're seeing the fans and everyone's into it. And yeah, it keeps you pumped up. Hey, sports fans, if you want to watch more sports seriously, be sure to check out these clips right here. And make sure you're subscribed to the channel to see all the great content from us here at USA Today Sports.